It's in it's in your blood. You can't help it. Yeah. Or the other. Oh, hold on. My mom's calling me. Oh, I felt that vibration for some reason. <laughs> What's up? Okay. Okay. Three minutes. Okay. Okay. Love you too. Bye. Bye, mom. Mom. Mom's bringing home Taco Bell. I heard. Oh shit! Really? Yeah, we all heard. Damn. Now they. Oh no. <laughs> Great, put it in the video. <laughs> no, cool. not my mother. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna get Taco Bell in like three minutes. Ariel's mother, if you watch my videos. Hello. You don't. Doesn't. <laughs> I know. No <laughs> mother watches my videos. Bruh. No mother should watch your videos. Yeah. No one yeah. should watch your videos. Damn. <laughs> but damn. they're here anyways. Oh shit. For some damn anyways, reason. Anyways. If you guys want good content, subscribe. <laughs> if you want good like. content, you're not gonna find it here. <laughs> if you want good content, go somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> I would do the same advice for my stuff, honestly. Don't don't if think you it's want, just go, if shitting if on you. Want, you. If you <laughs> want good content, Go to twitch.tv forward slash Dr. Puppy One. <laughs> Shut the <laughs> fuck up. All you do is camera. play Minecraft. Don't you? Yeah. And that's, <laughs> that's, it's really hot. Minecraft Damn, is really, plug. really like popular these days. So, no. <laughs> yes. You ever seen the Dream SMP? <laughs> oh, my God. oh, no. No. <laughs> I wear a mask. That's what the mask is for. That's what the mask is. That's what the mattress. That's what the point of the mattress. Okay. <laughs> point of the, the mask, mask is. is. <laughs> <laughs> My God. <laughs> and all I ever mattress. I wear Why a are you so mattress? Now we're at a time. Something. It's something. <laughs> Uh, Damn, we, this is supposed to be a Doki Doki video. What are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing with our life? Uh, nothing. How much, wait. How much time have we wasted? <laughs> a <Five> lot. <laughs> cut this out, cut this out. No, keep it in, no. keep it in. <laughs> keep it in. It'd be funny. All do right. what I do with this Anyways, freaking... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna open up... Oh, should I open up Steam? <laughs> Bruh. I mean, you have to open up Steam to get to the game, I guess. No, I, I have the game uh, here on a shelf. Oh, you have it on your uh, desktop? Ew. I only have a few games like that. <laughs> I don't have all my what? games like that. You're just all not right. using your desktop. All characters are over the age of 18. <laughs> yes. What? Don't see why this is so funny. No, because they were like, hmm, school, children, people are making lewd shit about this. Hmm. Yeah. People from anxiety or depression may not have a positive experience playing this game. Would you like really? to read detailed content warnings, which contain spoilers, alternatively in-game? Uh, content warnings can be enabled in the setting menu at any time. Yes, con contain spoilers. No. All right, guys, no spoilers. No spoilers. But if you are... As this is crazy. I've never played this game before. Me it looks like it looks so cutesy and like it's a lot of fun. I can't wait. Play. Playing Doki Doki Literature Club. You agree that you have noted the game's age rating in your region and consent to exposure of highly disturbing content. Yes, let's do this. Let's be tortured again mentally. How disturbing can it be? Am I right? Hey, Team Salado. I'm gonna get a drink. Howdy do, guys and gals, Blackness here. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we are playing Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. I'm, there's no plus here, but you get the point. Extra content, hours of gameplay. 
You know, why doesn't it say paused? I I don't know. Anyways, I've already played the game. All of us have. Uh, we already know what happened. So if you're looking for genuine reactions, you're gonna have to go back into like 2017 or 18, man, to look at someone else's gameplay. What do you mean? I've never played this game before. Wow. Yeah, you're actually right. I think I have amnesia now. I don't remember anything from the game. Crazy. Anyways, Natsuki is on my shoulder. Yes. I have a little Natsuki right here. But, sadly, we're not gonna choose her route. But yeah. yeah. We're not choosing Natsuki's route. We're going with Yuri. Hey guys, I'm just walking in to ask, are you just- are you just go No, you're not going without us? Hi guys. No, yeah. we haven't gotten out. Of course not. <laughs> just- just as a <laughs> quick update. Uh, mo mom brought soft shell tacos. Hell yeah. And three send me medium some. Pepsis. No, I will not send you some. Damn it, Lena. Good. Anyways, I'm gonna go back up. Um, Alright. We should do the route with the one with the red bow. I wanna do that route. That- that sounds awesome. You know what? All right, let's go Sayori, because I remember I did not ski in Yuri lesson. All right, we're gonna get the bundle with the way here. Monica, what's up? Big thigh. Hello. Guys and green Hello. Eyes. Anyways, hopefully, uh, oh yeah, sorry. I haven't introduced, yeah, Xenix is here. Wow, so is everyone. Yeah, that I am. Doc. <laughs> Did you not know that? <laughs> no, they didn't. You invited us here. Oh, did I? We've invited her. No, we walk up. We walk up here. <laughs> you walk up already this. in call. I don't know what's happening? I'm getting too old for this. What are you? Eighteen. You think you're too old for this? Bruh, I'm 19. I'm living my golden years already. <laughs> Alright, new game. Please enter your name. Dipshit. Guys. Dipshit. No. <laughs> no. Ah. <laughs> uh... No. <laughs> Dear God, no. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Don't no. make us say that. Don't no. make us say that. <laughs> I refuse. <laughs> I'll call you bitch boy. Call us that. Or call yourself that. Alright, uh. Let's just go with Rigby. Why not? What? No, uh. uh Rigby! Not Adventure Time. Regular show. Adventure Time! You know, you could have fooled me. <laughs> could have fooled me. Right. Your line. I'm a fucking where. Hold on. Dude. I was taking a sip of my Pepsi. All right. <laughs> From my not sponsored <laughs> Mountain Dew. Oh, shit, right. Not sponsored by Pepsi or Mountain Dew. <laughs> not <laughs> sponsored. All right. Gamer Taco fuel. Bell. <laughs> hey, hey. bro. Hey. I see an annoying girl running toward me from the distance. Waving her arms in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. That girl is Sayori, my neighborhood and good friend since we were children. You know, the kind of friend you'd never see yourself making today. But it just kind of works out because you've known each other for so long. We used to walk to school together on days like this. Starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently. I would get tired of waking up. But if she's going to, ch if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. However, I just sigh and idle in front of the crosswalk and let Sayori, Sayori catch up to me. You can go ahead. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna pant. No. <laughs> what? What? It's just a little moaning. I <laughs> don't. No. <laughs> <Why not? laughs> I overslept again. But I caught you this time. 
Nate Rigby. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, it's all name problem. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no. Holy oh, shit, hold on. Let me turn this volume down. Holy crap. No, full blast. No. <laughs> blast your ears. Alright. Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. <laughs> you say. Oh, wait. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you say that like you were thinking about ignoring me. That's mean, Rigby. <laughs> 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 Well, if people stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. Fine, fine. But you did wait for me after all. <laughs> I'm sorry to anybody who's named Rigby out there. <laughs> is anyone actually named Rigby? Wait, no! Rigby's a real name? Rigby's an actual name. Is... No, dear God, it is not. No, please. I anybody mean, who's born after the point of the show, right. um... Yeah. Regular I'm show, sorry, but your parents name. hated you. <laughs> 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 no, it's a fine name, guys. It's okay. Right, it's an alright name. No... It's just. Yeah. <laughs> I guess you don't have it in you to be mean. Oh shit! If you wanted to, <laughs> even if you wanted to. Whatever you say, say whatever you say, Siri. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, I didn't see the comma. <laughs> we cross the street together and make our way to school. Angelica, no. <laughs> As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their daily commute. By the way, Rigby, have you decided on a club to join yet? Uh, a club? I told you already, I'm not interested in joining any clubs. I haven't been looking either. And that's not true. You told me you want, or uh, you would join a club this year. Did I? I'm sure it's possible that I did. In one of the, our many conversations, where I dismissively go along with whatever she's about going on about. Siori likes to worry a little too much about me, when I'm perfectly content just getting by on the average, while spending my free time on games and anime. Uh huh. I was talking about how I'm worried that you won't learn how to socialize or have any skills before college. Your happiness is really important to me, you know? And I know you're happy now, but I'd die at the thought of you becoming a neat in a few years. Because I'm not you're neat, not- oh God! Jesus. <laughs> I'm like a yeet in a few years. I said a neat, Jesus Christ. Dude, dude fucking took- personal offense from that mm -hmm. because he knows he is mm -hmm. all right <laughs> because but also me to, too he used to live in the real world damn me too you trust me right don't make me keep worrying about you all right all right i'll look at a few clubs if that makes you happy no promises though will you at least promise me that you'll try a little yeah, I guess I'll promise you that. Yay! <laughs> that was fucking cute, oh my god. You shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll shut up, I'll shut up. <laughs> Why did I let myself get lectured by such a carefree girl? More than that, I'm surprised I even let myself relent her. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want to ease her- To ease her mind up at a little- at least a little I bit. Even if she bro. does exaggerate everything inside of her head. Sorry. Bro, main don't character say anything. Can't read. Don't say anything. <laughs> main Just let him trip. <laughs> Just let him trip. <laughs> School day is as ordinary as ever. It's over before I know it. After I pack my my things, I stare blankly at the wall, looking for an ounce of motivation. That's deep. <gasps> Yo, there's a PC over here! <laughs> oh shit, there is! Hey yo! <laughs> DDLC no. on here. Bruh, this new update is wild. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> clubs? Siori wants me to check out some clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start with the anime club. Fucking weeb. Shut your mouth, you a weeb too, and you know it. And anime. 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 
I hope they have my hero academia. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a demon slayer kind of guy. Bro, uh -huh. you want you want demon slayer, bro? <laughs> Fucking cringe. Watch Arrow Manga Sensei. <laughs> I was gonna contribute oh. to this, but then I was just gonna get bullied even more if I did. <laughs> anyway. Hello? So is he Ori? Oh, that one. Oh. It's fine. <laughs> and so he must have come into the classroom while I was spacing out. I look around and realize that I'm the only one left in the classroom. I thought I'd catch you coming out of your class, but I saw you just sitting here and spacing out, so I came in. Honest Honestly, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. You don't need to wait up for me if it's going to make you late to your own club. Well, I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know. Know what? Well, the you'd come to my club. Sayori. Yeah? There is no way I'm going to your club. <laughs> Meanie. Sayori is vice love. president of the literature club. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I was ever, ever aware that she made any interest in literature. In fact, I'm 99% sure she only did it because she thought it would be fun to help start a new club. Since she was the first one to show interest after the one who proposed the club, she inherited the title Vice President. Man, that was a good goal right there. Sorry. That said, that said, my interest is liter in literature is guaranteed to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Come on, please. Why do you care so much, anyway? Well... I kind of told the club yesterday I would bring a new member. And Natsuki made cupcakes and everything. <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep. I can't tell if Sayori is really that much of an airhead or is she so cummy cunning as Bro. to have planned all over it all of this out. God damn. I let out a long sigh. Fine. <sighs> I'll stop by for a cupcake, okay? <laughs> yes, let's go! I'll just mute myself if I need to take a drink. I'm sorry for the- No, leave it in, leave it in. You're good, Leave it in. Real <laughs> it the the goal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. It'd be funny, leave and it thus in. today. And thus today thus marks the day I sold my soul for a cupcake. Jesus Doom Christ. music starts <laughs> playing. This? Fucking Doom music starts playing. <laughs> I dejectedly follow Sayori across the school and upstairs, the section of the school I rarely visit. And now the horror game. Full of energy, <laughs> swings open the club classroom. Done, 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 done. Oh my god, it's a classroom. <laughs> oh my oh god. My god. It's a oh, classroom. I love the music. All right. <laughs> Hey, hey, let's go. Cool. Everyone, the new member is here. I told you, don't call me a new member. Eh? I glance around the room. Welcome to the Literature Club. It's a pleasure to meet you. Sayori always says nice things about you. First lady, you brought a boy? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Way to kill the atmosphere, motherfucker! <laughs> Jesus Christ! I told you I'd be aggressive, man. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Like, who the fuck is this? <laughs> no, welcome to the club or whatever. We're just, we're just adding our own dialogue. <laughs> All words escape me in this situation. This club yeah. is full of incredibly hot, handsome. Yeah, cute girls. <laughs> what are you looking at? If you want to say something, say it. I feel like you're gonna lose. Sorry. Me. Natsuki. Bitch, what? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, what, huh? <laughs> the girl with the sour attitude, whose name is apparently Natsuki, is one I don't recognize. Her small figure makes her look like a first year student. She's also 
and the one who made the cupcakes, according to Sayori. You can just ignore her when she's moody. Hey, on this big slaps. <laughs> <laughs> Sayori says that quietly into my ear and turns back towards the other girls. Anyways, this is Sayori, always full of energy. Uh, my name's Sayori what? now. Natsuki! <laughs> this is Natsuki! Natsuki Sayori, no, Natsuki Sayori, Natsuki. Why is Natsuki Sayori? The smartest in the club. I think that's my line, I'm so, I'm so confused. Don't say things like that. Bruh, don't... Yuri, who appears comparably more mature and timid, seems to have a hard time keeping up with people like Sayori and Natsuki. Ah, well... Nice to meet you both. Oh, uh, both of you. And it sounds like you already know Monica. Is Means that right? It's the same thing, bro. Uh, that's <laughs> right, or whatever. <laughs> As or whatever. <laughs> Just every sentence. Every sentence. It looks like it's okay to see you again. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Hand holding. Woo! Oh. Monica smiles sweetly, but she gives me a death glare. We do know each other. Well, we rarely talk, but we were in the same class last year. Monica was probably the most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic, basically completely out of my league. Yep. So having yep. her smile at me, so genuinely, feels a little... <laughs> you, you, you too, Monica. Come sit down, Rigby. We made room for you at the table, so you can sit next to me or Monica. I'll get the cupcakes! Hey, I made them! I'll get them! <laughs> Sorry, I got a little too excited. No, then how about I make some tea as we? As we! As well! <laughs> some tea as we! As we! And that's when Yuri murdered everyone and turned them into tea. <laughs> Girls have a few desks arranged to form a table. As he already mentioned, it's been widened so that there is one space next to Monica and one space next to Sayori. Natsuki and Yuri walk over to me. Walk over to the corner of the clip the room where Natsuki grabs a wrapped tray and Yuri opens the closet. Still feeling awkward, I take a seat next to Sayori. Natsuki prob proudly marches oh, back hopefully. to the table. Yeah, most tray likely. Again. Okay, you ready? Here it is. Whoa! Natsuki lifts the foil off the tray to reveal a dozen white, fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. The whiskers are drawn with icing, and little pieces of chocolate were used, were used to make ears. So cute! I had no idea you were so good at baking, Natsuki. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> <laughs> Take one. <laughs> <laughs> so he grabs one first, then Monica. I follow. <laughs> so delicious! She already talks with her mouth full and has already managed to get icing on her face. I turn the cupcake around in my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. Natsuki is quiet. I can't help but notice her sneaking glances in my direction. The music starts playing. <laughs> <laughs> the icing is sweet and full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. This is really good. Thank you, Natsuki. I hope it tastes good. Uh. <laughs> are you just are you just skipping after she says anything? <laughs> Pretty much. That's yeah. just your dialogue. Yeah, new dialogue. Uh, <laughs> new old, new dialogue, for... guys. It's crazy. <laughs> this is the new gameplay. It's so realistic. It's the new. It's the new update. I didn't make them for you. They're not for you. <laughs> Just spit that out and pay me. <laughs> huh? I thought you technically did. Sayori said. Sayori's a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Okay. All right, all right. I give up on Natsuki's weird logic and dismiss the conversation. Yuri returns to the table, carrying a tea set. She 
carefully places a teacup in front of each of us before setting down the teapot next to the cupcake tray. You keep up the whole tea set in this classroom? Don't worry, the teacher gives us permission. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? Ah, yeah, yes. I guess. <laughs> Don't let your girls, yourself get intimidated. Yuri's just trying to impress you. N that's not... Insulted, Yuri looks away. I meant that, you know... I believe you. Well, tea and reading might not be pastime for me, but at least, I at least enjoy tea. I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Monica raises an eyebrow, then smiles at me. <sighs> so what made you consider the literature club? Um, I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monica that I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Oh, I haven't joined any clubs yet, and Sayori- Give me the wrong answer and I'll kill you. really happy here, so- <laughs> Oh, that's okay. Don't be embarrassed. We'll make sure you feel right at home. Okay? Uh... As a president of the Literature Club, it's my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. <laughs> Damn, why is she saying that like the main antagonist? <laughs> Anyways. Monica, I'm surprised. How come you decided to start your own club? You could probably be a board member for any major clubs of the major clubs. Weren't you a leader of the debate club last year? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, okay. To be honest, I can't stand all the politics around the major clubs. It feels like nothing but arguing about the budget and publicity and how to prepare for events. I'd much rather take something I personally enjoy and make something real special out of it. And if it encourages others to get into literature, then I'm fulfilling that dream. Monica's really is a great leader. Yuri also nods in agreement. And I'm surprised there aren't more people in the club yet. Fuck you, bitch. It must be hard to start a new club. We're trying. <laughs> you can put you? it that way, asshole. <laughs> How many people are very interested in putting out all that effort to start something? Bruh. Especially when it's something that doesn't grab your attention, like literature. You have to work hard to convince people that you're both fun and worthwhile. Unlike you. Oh, oh. But it makes school <laughs> events like, the, fest hands. like the festival <laughs> much more important. Doki Doki Fight Club more like that. <laughs> 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 There's still the literature club. Don't talk about the literature club. Literature club. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> w W E D D L C edition. Let's go. I'm confident that we, we can all really grow as this, <laughs> this club before we graduate. <laughs> Right, everyone? WWE. Yeah! <laughs> we'll do our best. Yeah, uh, you know it. Everyone enthusiastically agrees. Such different girls, all interested in the same goal. Monica must have worked really hard just to find these three. Maybe that's why they're all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. Though, I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm about literature. So, Rigby, what kind of things do you like to read? Well, uh... Considering how little I've read in these past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. Manga? I mutter, I mutter quietly to myself, half-jokingly. Hey, Natsuki's head suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not much of a reader, I guess. Look, I dropped my glass. Oh, fuck. Well, that can change. What am I saying? I spoke without thinking after seeing Yuri's sad smile. 
Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, let's see. <clears throat> Yuri traces the rim of her teacup with her finger. My favorites are usually novels that build deep and complex fantasy worlds. The level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. And telling a good story is such a foreign in such a foreign world is equally impressive. Yuri goes on, clearly passionate about reading. She seemed to be so she seems so reserved, timid since the moment I walked in, but it's obvious by the way her eyes light up that she finds her comfort in the world of books, not people. But you know, I like a lot of things. Stories with deep psychological elements can usually immerse me as well. Psychological. Isn't it psychological. amazing how a writer can so deliberately take advantage of your own lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop? Completely throw you for a loop. Completely <laughs> for a loop. <laughs> anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. Horror. <laughs> ah, I read a horror book once. I desperately grasped something I can relate at the, to at the, the min, 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 minimal level. Oh my god. You got it. You got there. Yuri might be, <laughs> this won't be having a conversation with The Rock. Really? I wouldn't have expected that, Yuri. For someone as gentle as you? I guess you could say that. But if a story makes me think, or takes me to another world, then I really can't put it down. Surreal horror is often very successful at changing the way you look at the world, if only for a brief moment. <laughs> Your mic did not pick up Lena, but I heard what? you from the other room. <laughs> Anyways, uh, like I was saying, I hate horror. Uh, that's too much like horror. <laughs> <laughs> uh, why is that? Uh, well, I, uh... Natsuki's eyes start over to me for a split second. Never mind. Oh, I get it. She's a little bitch. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> I'll throw a hand! <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you usually like to read about cute things, don't you, Natsuki? Which one? What gives you that idea? Why did she turn southern? southern? I'm getting <laughs> aggressive, so I turned southern. <laughs> like, you piece of crap. Sorry, I read that wrong. You left a piece of scrap paper behind club last, last club meeting. Yeah. It looks like you were working on a poem called... Don't say it. Or don't say it. Give it back. Or I'll throw hands. <laughs> fine, fine. <laughs> your cupcakes, your poems. Everything you do is just as cute as you are. She already sidled, siddles, sidles up to Natsuki and puts her hands on her shoulders. I am not cute, you motherfucker. <laughs> I will throw hands. <laughs> Natsuki, you you write your own poems? I I guess I don't know sometimes. Why why you care? Why you care? I think that's impressive. Why don't you share them sometime? No. Natsuki averts your eyes. You you just won't like them. Just won't like them. <laughs> ah, not a very confident writer yet. All Southerners repeat what they say like five times over. You won't like them. <laughs> yeah, no. I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing that level of writing takes more than just confidence. The truest form of writing is writing to oneself. You must be willing to open up to your readers, exposing your vulnerabilities and showing even the deepest reaches of your heart. Do you have a writing experience too, Yuri? Maybe if you share some of your work, um, I can set an example for Natsuki to feel comfortable enough to share hers. Uh... <laughs> Show me your vulnerabilities. Oh, I want to 
want to read everyone's poems. Too bad, Sayori. I'll sit in silence for a moment. Okay. <laughs> Listen, I have an idea, everyone. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> huh? Natsuki and Yuri look quizzically at Monica. Let's all go home and write a poem of our own. Then the next time we meet, we'll share them all with each other. That way everyone's even. <laughs> I, I, I hear her in the other room trying to make this sound, but it's not picking up in her mic. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a loud, like, uh... No, yeah. <laughs> like, mic hold on. Up a <laughs> like, this is what I hear. My mic is sensitive enough to pick it up. Just... Uh... <laughs> 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 from the other room. I think there's uh... something comical about hearing it from the other room. There is. <laughs> Yuri says dot, dot, dot. <laughs> 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 yeah, let's do it. Plus, now that we have a new member, I think it'll help us get a little more comfortable with each other. Strengthen the bond of the club. Isn't that right, Rigby? That is... That's a third of teeth. Jeez. <laughs> Rigby. Rigby. Monica smiles warmly at me once again. Hold on. There's still one problem. And what's that? Now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I bluntly come up, come forth with what's been on my mind the entire time. I never said I would join this club. Yori may have convinced me to stop by, but I never made any decision. I still have other clubs to look at, and, um, I lose my train of thought. All four girls stare back at me with de de dejected eyes. Near a little asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought. Bam. Here we be. Yo. <laughs> I'm defenseless Yo. against these girls. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> How am I supposed to make a, a <laughs> edit decision? When it, it's like this. <laughs> that is. If writing poems is the price I need to pay in order to spend every day with these beautiful girls. Right. Okay, I've decided then. I'll join the literature club. One by one, your face. eyes light up. Yay! I'm so happy! Siori wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey! You really did scare me for a moment. If you really just came for the cupcakes, I'd be super pissed. <laughs> well, that makes it official. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> <laughs> now you're stuck in here with me. <laughs> then that makes it official. Welcome to the Literature Club, Rigby. Oh, thanks, I guess. Okay, everyone. I think that we can officially end today's meeting on a good note. We've got a new soul! I mean a new member. <laughs> Everyone remember tonight's assignment? <laughs> next page. Thank you. <laughs> Write a poem to bring to the next meeting so we can all share. Monica looks at over at me once more. Rigby? I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. Hey, should we Can bring- Can I really impress wait, wait. the, the class, class star, Monica, with my mediocre writing skills? No. I already feel the anxiety <laughs> welling up inside me. Good. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit-chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. <laughs> the girls, aka the only other one that's really not doing anything. Uh, hey, Rigby, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? That's right. Sayori and I never walk home together because, anymore because she always stays after school for clubs. 
Sure, might as well. <laughs> Yay! The whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between the four girls. Siori, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course, Monica. Will I really be no, happy spending <laughs> every day after after school in the literature book? Perhaps I'll have the chance to grow closer to one to one of these girls. All right, I'll just need to make the most of my circumstances, and I'm sure good fortune will I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess that starts with writing a poem tonight. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! So I can only get closer to. Oh, dude, there's some bots. I know. Mm -hmm. Okay, should I add, uh, Tyler? Cause I saw him Time like the, poem. I saw him like that one image on Insta. So should I add Tyler? Like pick like, words. Eh. Pick words. The thing favorite club going. member will like. Yes. Hold on. <laughs> pick words that you think your favorite club Tyler. member will like. Oh, look at them bounce around. Okay. Like little jelly beans. Oh, she, she zoomed. Oh my god. Oh my god. What happened? Look at the bottom. Look at the bottom left. They just zoom in. They zoom in. Oh Holy shit. Holy shit. They're not it's bouncing fast. like little jelly beans Yo, anymore. They're just zooming. I got Natsuki right here. It's the same Yo. as my plushie. I, I should hope so. I should hope so. Same face and everything. Let's go. All right, all right. Enough of that. Who are we going for? Uh, poem. Yeah, who are we going Probably. for? Who are we going Ribbon. for? Uh oh. oh. Is oh. this? Wait, are you playing Sunset. Doki Doki Plus or? It's this Doki is... Doki Plus. Okay. This is this is. All right, wait. You uh, got you got. She's a girl. Which one are you going for? Who are we who are we had? Who's our head? Oh, uh oh. Idea. Stop. Uh, Haha. <laughs> Four twenty. Lipstick. No. Uh -oh. fuck. No, please. I don't want to leave the sun there. I don't want to be. Lena's like, I regretted this decision. I don't want to be. I don't want to be. I don't want to no. flirt as the sun or No. Sweet. But, uh, but, uh, yay. I'm too perfect to be gone. Music. <laughs> Music. Hell yeah. <laughs> Uh, Summer! Oh. Shit. Oh, shit. Friends! Uh, friends. Yes. Don't we're bad at this. We are. Special. Lucky dance. Uh, special. Oh, well, well. You idiot. <laughs> yeah. I don't it's remember. just ingrained in your, in, your, in your brain to go for Natsuki, I'm pretty sure. It, it, probably. Uh, then you'd have to deal with me more. Ah! Uh, ha! Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> well, we're either getting. <laughs> I don't know which one it is. So. We're either getting Natsuki or we're getting Sayori because you didn't choose any of Yuri. So. Hi again, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> deserved. Well deserved. <laughs> Big deserved. Yeah. Glad to see you didn't run away on us. <laughs> nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but I at least keep my word. Well, I'm back at the literature club. I was the last last to come in, so everyone else is already hanging out. Thanks for keeping your promise, Rigby. I hope this isn't too overwhelming of a commitment for you. Because I know you have problems with commitment. Making you dive headfirst uh, into literature when nope. you're not accustomed to Damn. it. Damn. Come on. Like he deserves any slack. <laughs> they already told me that you didn't even want to join a club this year. And last year, too, I was taking a sip of my fucking Pepsi. I mean, non brand soda? <laughs> yeah, my off brand caramelized soda. Anyways, <laughs> um, I don't know if you just plan here to hang out or what. Yeah, yeah I've said the line. One, I think. Didn't oh, I shit, yeah. Yeah, but if you don't take us seriously, you won't see daylight tomorrow. 
<laughs> Natsuki, calm the fuck down. No. <laughs> you certainly have a big mouth for someone who keeps her manga collection in the club room. Bro, shut up, it's my lines. <laughs> yup, bitch. Natsuki finds herself stuck between saying Monica and manga. Boy. Boy. Manga is literature. Swiftly defeated, Natsuki plops her back into her seat. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. Whoa, my computer decided to do a thing. Rigby always gives his best as long as he's having fun. He helps me with busy work without what? <laughs> he helps me with busy work without <laughs> even asking. Like cooking, cleaning my room. How dependable. Sorry, that's because your room is so messy. It's distracting. And you almost set your house on fire once. Is that so? <laughs> you two are really good friends, aren't you? I might be a little jealous. Shut the fuck up, Yuri. Stay away from me and Sayori. Well, fucking damn. <laughs> 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 How come? You and Rigby could become good friends, too. Um. Too bad I didn't choose any of your words, Yuri. I know. <laughs> it's Sayori. Mm-hmm. As usual, Sayori seems oblivious to the weird situation she just put me into. Oh, Yuri, uh, Yuri even brought you some something today, you know? Wait, Sayori. Uh, me? Uh, not really. Don't be shy. But some more. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry. It's <laughs> it's really nothing. What is it? Never mind. Yuri made it sound like a big deal when it's really not. Yuri made it sound like a big deal. I said Sayori, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do I do? Um, I'm sorry, Yuri. I wasn't thinking. I guess I made it up to me to rescue the situation. Hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So, any nice gesture for me is a pleasant surprise. It'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? Yeah. I won't make a big deal if you don't want it to be. Alright. Well, here. Yuri reaches into her bag and pulls out an AK-47. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want you to feel like that. Uh, it would oh, be a quiet pistol. one. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> voice, voice enabled. Uh, Pop I, off. I didn't want you to feel left out. So I picked out a book that I thought you might enjoy. It's a shorter read, so it should keep your attention, even if you don't usually read. Because I know you're an incompetent bitch. And we could, you know... Excuse me. I almost went under the radar. <laughs> it almost did. It almost did. Yeah. Also, I don't think Sayori roasts people enough. I think we should fix that. <laughs> oh, <fine>. Okay. <laughs> no, it just seems awful though. Going. Why would she? No, no, she's Sebastian. <laughs> <laughs> Discuss it if you wanted. This, this is. She's the only. She's the no, so Sayori's only gonna be the shit. only nice one. <laughs> Damn. How is this girl accidentally being so cute? Bruh. She even picked out a book she thinks I'll like, despite me not reading much. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. The fact that you don't realize that I have a book. giant crush on you makes just... You're dumb. Wait, That's what just... The fuck we're... Oh. <laughs> so, facts. facts. That's just facts. That's just straight facts. Fucking Rigby, am I right? Fucking Rigby. Uh, fucking Rigby. An incompetent piece of shit. Well, you can read it on your own pace. Rigby, the plank of wood. <laughs> yes. I look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in, I expected Monica to kick someone out to 
kick off some scheduled activities for the club. Kick out someone. But that, doesn't, <laughs> <laughs> but that doesn't seem to be the case. Get the so fuck out of here. have a cheery conversation in the corner. Yuri's face is already buried in the book. I can't help but notice her, her intense expression. Like she was waiting for this chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rummaging around in the closet. Oh, we're going to Natsuki. <laughs> Have fun, y'all. This is all the new Damn it, I thought I chose more Sayori. <laughs> no. Nope. It's so the nerd I think this is just a natural thing. <laughs> oh, There's an auto save. I can go back. <laughs> I, no, I think no. this is just a natural thing. What you this isn't the, to... the literature part of it. This isn't the poem part of it. This is just a natural story. No, it. this is the poem part. It is it? Yeah. But Monica didn't even say shares poems yet. No, 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 no. The event, whenever you do the poem stuff, the event yeah, happens you before you share the poems. I guess it's my time. <laughs> <laughs> It's yeah, time right. to relentlessly yeah. bully. Fuck, we gotta That's deal with this. We gotta stuff. deal with mm. this. <laughs> with the like horrible no southern one, accent. Looks like no with one wants to be bothered today. Southern accent. I slumped down in, into the nearest desk. How am I supposed to occupy myself with something literature related about myself like this? I guess I could always read, <clears throat> read some of the book Yuri gave me, but I'm feeling a little too tired to read. I could probably fall asleep right now. I close my eyes and end up listening in, in on Sayori. Sayori's in conversation with Monica. We're probably gonna seem really lame compared to all the other clubs, though. Hmm. This is new. <laughs> well, we can't give up. Festival is our chance to show everyone what the Literature Club is all about. Problem is that shit you brought. I mean, the idea of the literature club sounds too dense and intellectual. <laughs> it's not like that at all, you know? We just need a way of showing that to everyone. Something that speaks to their creative minds. Mm. It doesn't solve the problem, though. Eh? What do you mean? Even if we come up with the most fun thing ever, nobody will come in the first place if it's a literature event. So it's more important to figure out how to get people to show up in the first place, you know? Hold them at gunpoint, that damn, at the heart. Because literature is so fucking boring. And I'm after they come, this guy now. <laughs> and after they come, we can do the thing to speak to their creative minds. What's this? Sayori is talking this really seriously? Taking this. Taking. Talking this really oh, seriously. Talking this. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's right here. Deliberately liberating like this. Huh. That's a good point. You're getting too smart. I <laughs> mean, in that case, <laughs> do you think food will do the trick? What kind? Uh, well, I guess we could. Cupcakes! <laughs> Good thinking. Damn, too many cupcakes, though. Something else, goddamn. Did we ask for your input? Sorry, buddy. Damn. I think you would love to do that. Damn! <laughs> oh, my fucking finger! What are you- it up against the table. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh, you're right. Natsuki, net what? Natsuki it's makes Natsuki. the best cupcakes. <laughs> no. Natsuki. Natsuki. <laughs> that works out perfectly. That'd be the greatest freaking nickname. <laughs> oh my Natsuki. god, Natsuki. Natsuki. Because she would hate it because it sounds cutesy. Yeah. Natsuki is so cutesy. That um. wasn't why you suggested it. Cupcakes speak to my creative dummy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. Cupcakes it is, then. <laughs> I'm hungry. Anyway... We still need to work out the details of the event itself. I find myself smiling. 
Vian. Fiori is still her usual self. Hey, is this part of the normal, like, route? No. no. This is new. No. This nope. is new, nope. bro. Yeah. But there, therein lies the unexpected reason I admire her. Unlike me, who has trouble finding any motivation at all. Fiori can put her mind into things and make them come to life. I suppose that's why I end up letting her get on my case about things. I can't help but wonder what it would be like to see the world through her eyes. Oh, oh shit, the scared <laughs> actually scared me. <laughs> Speaking of Shumster. seeing the world through my eyes. <laughs> I open my eyes to find Sayori's face filling my vision. I nearly fall out of my chair. <laughs> Sorry. Wait. Actually, I'm not sorry at all. Ooh. It's your fault for sleeping like that. This isn't the napping club. Oh shit. Does our school have a napping club? You're staying up late again, aren't you? Now that you're in a club, you're gonna have less time for anime, you know? You need to get used to it. Ooh. Fucking degenerate. so loud. Why? Because you're a fucking weed? Don't mess with me, sir. I got the power. Well, I <laughs> heard. And then. <laughs> Monica walks Damn. by and under her breath you hear. Jetter? Jetter. <laughs> Damn, hold up. Something. Hey, hey, guys! What's up? Coward. It's true, though. Yeah? I know, I know. You're always looking out for me, Sayori. <laughs> it's what I do best. That's a problem. What about you? You look out for me better than you look out for yourself. You're still oversleeping every day, aren't you? Uh, not every day. Not very convincing. Oh, How many days this past week have you gotten up on time? That's. It's a secret. I knew it. Come on. At least give me the benefit of the doubt. I can't even do that. Look, Sayori, it's written all over you. Huh? Sayori glances around at herself. How is it written all over me? You were clearly in a rush this morning. Look, your hair is still sticking out all 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 all, 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 all around here. Uh huh. I run my fingertips down the side of Sayori's hair, trying to straighten it out. Man, you really need a brush for this. My hair is really what is just really hard to get right. I won't fall for that. There's more than just your hair. Animators Look, talking to the fucking writers. Isn't straight. Mm. <laughs> There's a toothpaste stain on your collar right there. Oh, we are you doing Siri now. Why does she? I try to walk okay. with, wipe off the stain with my finger. But nobody would ever notice that. Of course you would. Nobody's gonna tell you about it because they don't want to embarrass you. Fortunately, I don't. I really do don't care about that. Hey, Mimi. And you don't even keep your blazer button up. Seriously, say it over. Why do you why do you think you don't have a boyfriend yet? Oh, oh fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> That's super mean. Sorry, but you'll thank me later. I That's probably won't. Asshole. Damn. Rigby, fuck you, Jesus. I fucking hate Rigby. Hey, a plank of wood. This MC is a plank of wood. I start to unbutton her blazer. I mean, I start to button her blazer from the bottom. <laughs> you wish, bud. Okay. <laughs> Once you see how much better it looks, you'll change your mind. Oh. Stop. <laughs> Stop. A child. This is kind of... A child. Her feet are actually kind of adorable, man. Ah, uh, the best angle. Her feet! Look at her feet! They're facing towards each other. Who stands like that? 
Okay. Well, like, one is space <laughs> for me, I do that sometimes. And then one is, like, away. <laughs> I do that sometimes, but also, who's a fun Stanley? Shut up, Ariel. Uh... <laughs> that is so funny. What is? Well... I just... I was just thinking how weird it is to have a friend who does these kind of things. That's called a friends with benefits. Huh? No, that's a different case. Don't that's that. a different case altogether. <laughs> 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 Not that, that type of benefit. You, you make me feel weird about it. Stupid. It's okay, though. I'm happy we're like this. Aren't you? Uh... I guess. Hey, be careful. The mutton. <laughs> the mutton. <laughs> the mutton. <laughs> Not even that. <laughs> I got thrown up by the line itself. The button might come off. Why is this one so hard to close? I struggle to fully close the button near her chest. Does this thing even fit you properly? <laughs> it did when I bought it. If you ever, un if you ever button it, you will. If you ever, uh, yeah, if you, yeah, yeah, whatever. If you ever yeah, buttoned it, it you would have noticed sooner. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't read that for some reason. What are you smiling about? No, oh my, <laughs> my booba has got bigger. It means my boobs got bigger again. Don't say that out loud. <laughs> Jesus, that was aggressive. <laughs> the cries of doom music starts playing. <laughs> no. Why is the main character so anyway. aggressive? <laughs> He's either he like so now. passive or so, so aggressive. You can't get I in mean, between. Luckily, it's offset by our voice actors. So. <laughs> 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 Me, I. Guess. We put it even more down the shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why does it feel feel strange to see Sayori's blazer buttoned up like that? But. But it's so stuffy. You. you. <laughs> it's not worth it at all. <laughs> Sayori hastily unbuttons her blazer once more. My question is, why is she missing a button? <laughs> like, I get... Fair enough. Anyway. Phew! That's so much better. Sayori puts her arms, around, arms out and twirls around. So if I keep it unbuttoned, then I won't get a boyfriend, right? What kind of logic is that? And why are you saying that like it's a good thing? Because! If I had a boyfriend, then he wouldn't even let me... Wait. Then he wouldn't even let you do things like this. Wait, I half expected you to say, Because I'm a lesbian! <laughs> 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 Whole and... narrative changes. <laughs> and you take care of me better than anyone else would. So that's why I keep it unbuttoned. Stop saying all these embarrassing things! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. I didn't say anything embarrassing, you're just being a little bitch about it. You're being a little shallow ass. <laughs> <laughs> a woman Jeez. wants to ride your bones, dude. Get a hint. <laughs> anyway, just focus on trying to wake up a little earlier. Only if you focus on going to bed earlier. Fine, fine. It's a deal. <laughs> I guess we really are better or yeah better taking care of each other than we are taking care of ourselves yeah i guess so huh so maybe you should come wake me up in the morning you're doing it again sayori oh, yeah. oh but it was a joke this time <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> man it's impossible to tell with you sometimes Jerky's <laughs> right. just constantly screaming. Everything that comes out of his mouth. Oh, hey, Monica. Hey, everyone. <laughs> huh? Eh? Monica suddenly calls out. 
Why don't we like share our poems we wrote now? Yay! <laughs> I got lightheaded doing that. Yay! Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to read yours. <laughs> yeah, same. I felt so enthusiastic. Siori still trots away to retrieve her poem. Two horn dogs over here really going at it, huh? Damn. Damn. By the way, did you remember to write a poem last night? Ha, <laughs> no. Yeah, y yeah. My relaxation ends. I can't believe I agreed to, some to do something so embarrassing. I couldn't really find much inspiration since I've never re really done this before. Well, now that everyone's ready, why don't you, like, find someone to share it with? I can't wait! Siori and Monica enthusiastically pull out their poems. Siori is on a wrinkled sheet of loose leaf torn from the spiral notebook. On the other hand, Monica wrote, wrote hers in a composition notebook. I can already see Monica, Monica's pristine handwriting from where I sit. Natsuki and Yuri reluctantly comply as well, reaching into their bags. I do the same myself. Who should I show my poem to first? That's the voice act. <laughs> what the four-sided coin? Four-sided four -sided dice. Let's four -sided go. Coin. Yeah, four-sided dice. All right, do hold it. on. Let me oh, go. Hang on, I got you. I got you. I have my dice right here. I do too, dumbass. And here come You're the nerd. Okay, two. It's Natsuki. Fuck. Love <laughs> 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 <Well>, Sayori. <laughs> you slap Sayori. That's funny. Oh shit. Is anyone watching? I don't hate Natsuki. Why do you think I have a Natsuki plush? <laughs> the dice. I mean, we're though. gonna share it to everyone. Yeah. 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 So, yeah it's like, fine. I'm and definitely most comfortable sharing it with Sayori first. She's my good friend, after all. Hey, and I won't make fun of you. <laughs> huh? Oh? Bruh. Oh my goodness! This is so good, Rigby! Can you shut the fuck up? Stop the cap! <laughs> cap? <Wow. laughs> That's it. Pop off, Sayori. <laughs> eh? I love it! I had no idea you were such a good writer. Sayori, you must be seriously overreacting. I'm not I'm a good not... writer oh, at all. Shit. <laughs> I honestly have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> well, maybe that's why. Because I have no idea what I like either. <laughs> Jeez. I'm sure Yuri's opinion has to be a little more constructive than this. Well, Maybe even you. Nazis. Are you sure you don't like it? Just be just, just yeah, don't. because I wrote it. Huh? Well, I'm sure that's part of it. I think I understand you better than a lot of other people, you know. So when I read your poem, it's not just a poem. It's a Rigby poem, and that makes it feel extra special. Like, I can feel your feelings in it. Siri hugs the sheet of sheet against her chest. You're so weird, Siri. <laughs> I'm really happy just that she wrote one. It just reminds me of how you're really a part of the club now. Not to mention the fact that I'm standing in front of you in the club room. Uh, well, of course. I'm not really into it yet, but that doesn't mean I'll break my promise. See? It's like I said before, Rigby. Deep down, you're not selfish at all, you know? Bitch is fucking selfish as fuck. Trying new things <laughs> like this for other people. That's something that only really good people do. That's not you. <laughs> Thanks, Sayori! Or thanks, Sayori. I'm not sure if Sayori sees the full picture of my motivation here. Oh no, I, I do. I can't deny 
She's part of the reason I joined. <laughs> Siri ain't stupid. You <laughs> know how much this means to her. No. <laughs> I'm happy and gullible, but I'm not fucking stupid. <laughs> hey, I'm uh, yeah? Idiot, but I'm not stupid. <laughs> I'm an idiot, but I'm not stupid. <laughs> yeah. And I'm gonna make sure you have lots of fun here, okay? That will be my way of thanking you. Alright, I'm going to hold you to that then. Yay! Now you'll read my poem too, right? Don't worry, I'm really bad at this. <laughs> oh, I'll see you about that. Okay. Oh, it's me. Right. <laughs> what? <laughs> you want me to read it or? Yeah, you read it since it's your okay. phone. Um, dear okay. sunshine. I'm gonna go for this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that. Okay. Dear sunshine, the way you glow down through my blinds in the morning, it makes me feel like you missed me. Kiss my forehead to help me out of bed. Make me rub the sleepies, the sleepy from my eyes. Are you asking me to come out and play? Are you trusting me to wish away a rainy day? I look above, the sky is blue. It's a secret, but I trust you too. If it wasn't for you, I could sleep forever. But I'm not mad. I want breakfast. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> Sayori, this is... Just a guess, but did you wait until this morning to write this? No. Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you can't answer just a little bit to a yes or no question. I forgot to do it last night. <laughs> well, at least that makes me feel a little feel a little better about myself. Don't be mean. I still tried my best. Ah. Yeah, I didn't mean to say it that it was a bad poem. It came out nice, or how should I put it? It sounds just like you. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> okay, really? Yeah, especially the last line. I made eggs and toast. <laughs> you know you were late to school? It's bad to skip breakfast. I get all cranky. Oh, I guess there's no point in arguing. Anyway, thanks for showing me. <laughs> this is so much fun. Monica's the best. Ah, yeah. But next time, I won't forget. And I'm going to write the best poem ever. Well, I guess I look forward to it. Who should I show my poem to next? Not speed. Let's go with Monica so we don't piss the piss her off. Ah, <sighs> what do you want? <laughs> oh yeah, poems. Are you having a good time so far? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Glad to hear it. By the way, since you're new and everything, if you ever, like, have any suggestions for the club, like new activities or things we can do better, I'm always listening. Always. <laughs> Don't be afraid to bring things up, okay? Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Of course I'll be afraid to bring things up. I'm much better off just going with the flow until I'm more settled in. Anyway... Wanna share your poem with me? It's kind of embarrassing, but I guess I have to. <laughs> uh. Don't worry, Rigby. I already know it's shit. Fair enough. <laughs> and we're all a little embarrassed yeah, today, you know? But that's the sort of barrier we'll all learn to get past soon. Yeah, that's true. I hand Monica my poem. <laughs> I 
like this one! Once again, another liar! <laughs> Much as I like mine, calm. <laughs> oh my god, no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Makes you think of something Sari would like. Is that so? You and Sari are really good friends, right? I wouldn't be surprised if you had those sorts of things in common. Ah, well. You may be good friends, but Sayori and I are actually really different. Hmm. Well. That may be the case. But maybe there are also some similarities you wouldn't expect. The way she talks about you. Sounds like the two of you really care about each other's well-being. Even if you show it in different ways. It ends up being more similar than you'd think. So I think that's the kind of vibe I get when reading your poem. Hmm. You sure you're not reading into it too much? <laughs> that could be. <laughs> oh gosh, I sound like Yuri. Fucking bitch. What's wrong with sounding like me? <laughs> <laughs> but in any case, Sari's writing has a kind of gentle feel to it. I can tell that she likes exploring with emotions like happiness and sadness. <laughs> Who knew someone so happy would enjoy sad things too? Oh, yeah, that's totally unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> well, to each their own. And you shouldn't be afraid to experiment a little bit either. I'm sure I'll end up trying different things. A lot. It could take a while before I feel comfortable doing things. Doing this. Yeah, that's because you suck. <laughs> anyway, I'd love to see you try new things. That's the best way to kind of to find what kind of style suits you. Everyone else might be a little biased towards their own kind of styles. But I'll always help what finds you suits you the most. Me! <laughs> so don't force yourself to write in the way someone else wants you to write. It's not like you have to worry about impressing them or anything. <laughs> anyway, you want to read my poem now? Just dead silence. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm much better than you. <laughs> you sound pretty confident for someone who claims to be not very good. Oh, well, that's because I have to sound confident. Doesn't mean I always feel that way, you know. I see. Oh, let's read it then. Hole in wall. <laughs> it couldn't have been me. See, the direction the sparkle protrudes. A noisy neighbor? An angry boyfriend? I'll never know. I wasn't home. I peer outside for a clue. No. I can't see. I reel, blind, like a film out of the sun. But it's too late. My retina's already scorched with a permanent copy and the meaningless image. It's just a little hole. It wasn't too bright. It was so too deep, stretching forever into everything, a hole of infinite choices. I realize now that I wasn't looking in. I was looking out. And he, on the other side, was looking in. In where? Your mother! <laughs> 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 sure. 
So, like, what do you think, I guess? Hmm. It's very freeform, if that's the what you call it. That's his way Sorry, of saying I'm it sucks. Really, <laughs> I'm not really the right person to ask for feedback. <laughs> I didn't want yours anyways. Damn. Yeah, that kind of style's gotten really popular nowadays. That is, a lot of poems have been putting an emphasis on the timing between words and lines. When performed out loud, it can be really powerful. What was the inspiration behind this one? The deep void of the universe. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if I know how to put it. I guess you could say that I had some kind of epiphany recently. It's been influencing my poems a bit. Stop. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, something like that. I'm kind of nervous to talk about deep stuff like that, because it's... Okay, I thought you were saying something. <laughs> it's kind of coming on strong. <laughs> I almost read the line back soon. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe after everyone is better friends with each other. Yeah. Anyway... Here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> Sometimes when you're writing a poem or a story, shut up, you just... <laughs> yeah. You fixated on a specific point. If you try so hard to make it perfect, then you'll never make any progress. Just force yourself to get something down on the paper and tidy it up later. Another way to think of it is, if you keep your pen in the same spot for too long, you'll just get a big dark puddle of ink or blood. So just move your hand and go with the flow. That's my advice for today. Thanks for listening. Bye bye, Monica. I'll leave Natsuki for last. Uh, <laughs> Which, I need to take a piss! Holy crap! <laughs> Is he already pissing his pants? That's weird. <laughs> hey guys. Damn. It's Yuri. How y'all doing? Do music like this. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Just, uh... I love how the face of Fury looks like she's waiting for him too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she's waiting too. Yeah, we're all waiting. Because like huh? we're stuck in this situation. <laughs> and damn, how did I turn Sheldon? By the way, I don't know. It just sort of slipped. <laughs> all right, if Isn't you're gonna it... be southern, you gotta have an actual solid accent, you know. You're from Southern California. That's not the exact it's... southern that you need to be. Whatever, we're technically in Japan right now. I shouldn't even be here. <laughs> <laughs> so it doesn't matter. <laughs> you got a point. <laughs> I think there is an accented like Japanese. I don't know. Onichiwa. <laughs> <laughs> That's not it. That that that's not it. Sorry, <laughs> Gator. <laughs> that isn't it at all. You need a lie. What? Oh my, Roma Ocean never. <laughs> Stop! Fucking. <laughs> Alright, that's it. That's that's enough. Stop. Spare us, please. <laughs>
she's not even doing like a southern belle kind of accent. She's just. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's just, yeah. you know. I don't something. know what she's I'm not sure what, like. It, it's so. It's oh, it's such a. I don't know. <laughs> she's she's doing a hard accent, but the thing is, it's not pinpointing anywhere. It's not landing anywhere. <laughs> she's just up in the air. <laughs> I'm a southerner from the south. From south. From south. <laughs> Which south? <laughs> Yes. All south. <laughs> All of Liv. at the poem. <laughs> minute passes. More, more than enough time for her to finish reading. Fuck this. Um. Sucks. Oh. I'm sorry. I forgot to start speaking. Cap, you think it sucks? You know what? I'll I sucks. do, but you know what? I'm not gonna let you know that. Oh. Um. Damn. It's fine. Don't force yourself. I'm it's not. It's pretty cringe. It's pretty cringe. <laughs> I just need to put my thoughts into words. Hold on. Okay. This is your first time writing a poem, isn't it? Right? If it sucks, it sucks. Just say it sucks. God damn. It's not that hard to say. <laughs> or yeah... Why do you ask? I'm just making sure. I guess that it might be after reading through it. Ah, so it's that bad. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Did I just raise my voice? I'm sorry. Yuri buries her face into her hands. I couldn't help but notice that. It's been several minutes, and we really haven't gotten anywhere. Jesus Christ. Really well new people. It's fine, I really didn't notice. What were you saying? Right, um... It's just that there's a f specific writing habits that are usually typical of new ri writers. And having been through that myself, I kind of learned to pick up on them. I think the most notable thing is that I recognize is new writers, they try to make their style very deliberate. In other words, they tend to pick a writing style separate from the topic matter, and they form fit the two together. The end result is that both the style and expressiveness are weakened. When series finds your train of thought, it's as if her demeanor totally changed. Her stammering is completely gone. She sounds like an expert. Of course, that's not something you can be blamed for. There are so many different skills and techniques that go with the writing. Even a simple poem. Into a simple poem. Fuck, I can't. Okay, not just finding them and building them, but getting them to work together is probably the most challenging part. It might take you some time, but it all comes with practice and learning by example and trying new things. I also hope that everyone else in the club gives you valuable f feedback. Say or you probably not, but you know, she's just a ditzy stupid bitch. Natsuki can be a little biased, too. <laughs> biased? How? Um... Let's just say she'll stab you if you don't. She doesn't like it. <laughs> Damn straight. <laughs> well, <laughs> never mind. Stabby, stabby. Let me get my kitchen knife. The book. I shouldn't be talking about people like that. Hey, didn't you steal my pen last time? That no. hasn't happened yet. Chronologically. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm not sure if Yuri's apologizing to yourself. Or to me, or to Natsuki. Do you mind if I read your poem now? Please do. I'd love to share my thought process behind it. Yuri smiles dreamingly, as if that's a rare opportunity for her. Which itself is kind of funny. After all, isn't that supposed to be a literature club? Ghost under the light. That's short as fuck, oh goddamn. <laughs> Probably the deepest one, though. 
The tendrils well, of my hair illuminate. <laughs> That's why I'm reading as you're. The yeah. tendrils of my hair yeah, illuminate beneath the ember glow, bathing. It must be this one. The last remaining street light to have with it. Oh God, my voice. <clears throat> For <laughs> the last remaining street light to have withstood the test of time. The last yet to be replaced by the sickening blue-green hue of the future. I bathe. Calm, breathing air of the pe present, but living in the past. The light flickers. Hey, this, I flicker back. Is this, uh, the new soundtrack? I think it is. It does sound new. Hmm. It does sound It sounds different. different. The thing is, they they all have, like, a different I think they all have soundtrack a different tune to them for, for whenever you it open might be just revamped, No, that's... Right? It might be revamped, because it was yeah. in the last one, too. They had, like, different songs or whatever yeah, when they opened up the each. thing. But, um, it might be somewhat different. They might have cleaned it up a little. <sighs> uh... I'm sorry, I have such terrible handwriting. Bitch, what the fuck? Nick, it's in cursive. I can't read. Sorry. What? It's I'm in done. cursive. I'm done. I'm You're done. done? You're done? Bad hand. Shut up, woman. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't thinking that at all. Like, I, I, I didn't read it at all. I can't read cursive. But it took you a long time to read. That's why I can't fucking read it. <laughs> ah, well, I just don't read script very often. Oh, so you're stupid. I got you. I actually think your handwriting is... Petty. I'm pretty. Petty? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a relief. Also, I like the poem. Even though it's short, it was very, really descriptive. It wasn't too short. I usually write longer poems. Not at all. I'm really glad you like it. I'll be honest. Since it's our first time sharing, I wanted to write something a little more mild. Something easy to digest, I suppose. I did not get any of that with the host of Which really to be. just said, uh, I'm so much better than you <laughs> on a normal basis, but I just got down to your level this one time. <laughs> like, damn. <laughs> He's Are gone. You into ghost Yuri? Oh, what the fuck? Yuri's a ghost! Oh, she <laughs> is in the ghost. Quick, look behind you. Oh, Is she here? Uh, oh, she's gone! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she's a phantom. <laughs> she's not even in the same. That's it. Oh, no more Yuri. <laughs> I think we accidentally oh. deleted her character. Okay. Oh, I, okay. Yuri? Also, uh, you Actually, the yeah. story isn't... Oh, he... Okay, Who's just eating? go on. Sorry. Just, just keep going. Just Actually, keep going. the story isn't about ghosts at all, Rigby. I, I was the ghost the all along. <laughs> oh, where are the ghosts? Really? I found a bug. Yay! Yay! <laughs> done it. I must have totally missed the point. Well, I suppose you did only glance over it after all. But remember but that remember poets that often that express poets. their own oh. thoughts, feelings, and I'm oh, sorry. I like I mute myself to try and take a drink. <laughs> Main and, uh, character is that in, oh, no, their, it's all right. in their work. Anthony thought it was his line. That's why. Oh. Yeah. They no, usually MC do more than tell a simple story or paint a picture. In this case, perhaps the, the subject guy. of the poem is only. Shut the fuck up, Monica. It's not your Damn. turn to talk. <laughs> Lingering your last of comfort, unable to let go of the past. And soon to be left with nothing. It's a lot more solemn putting it that way. I haven't even thought of that. That's impressive. It's nothing, really. You're just stupid. Well, it makes me happy that you think that. Just remember that it won't be long before you pick up on these things, too. Yeah, maybe you're right. 
Well, so show yourself, Yuri. You're still invisible. No, I'd rather be a ghost. I, I guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's on brand. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll have to keep trying. I'm counting on it. On you. On. Yep. It's still the your God, finally, we've all been waiting. You we were done with our poems like 15 minutes ago, Yuri. Why? It's only one to just go straight to Natsuki. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> Fucking silence. Alright, let's start with things I don't like. First of all, Natsuki rereads my poem. Eh, never mind. You don't deserve my opinion. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, uh, Sorry. Then, what's the point of sharing in the first place? I wrote this when I could. I wrote this when I could have been doing other things. You, 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 you. <laughs> in fact, remember how I said I wanted to read your poems? That's what I had in mind when rewriting this. I want to help you feel comfortable enough to share yours. Like Monica said. You, 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 you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would be more comfortable with sharing my poem if yours was really bad. Which it we're is. Supposed it, shut up. You were supposed to show me some dumb poem. Made me go, hi, well, it's not that great, but let me show you what real literature looks like. And then you went and ruined that plan. Fucking <laughs> asshole. I hope you're happy. What? <laughs> So in other words, you're saying you liked it. Oops. Na Natsuki's retort gets caught in her throat. You are so... You, you just don't understand it nothing, do you? I told you that if you... <laughs> are you annoying with the accent? No. I hope you are. <laughs> <laughs> I already told you that if you have don't have to go announcing it to the world like you're all self-important, pretty sure you never pretty actually sure. step up. <laughs> I'll rig me now. I'm pretty sure you never actually said that. I say that mostly to myself. Natsuki must... Really hate me for saying something. No, stop! I can't figure it out. <laughs> it's the red. Can't figure out. Finally, it's the winner or loss. As the Let's only southerner in Japan, I'm going to take over <laughs> Japan. <laughs> Let's go. In any case, you still need to show me yours, right? Eh, uh, fine, I guess. Posing, only because Monica will make me if I don't. Yes, I will. Eagles can fly. Just <laughs> like the 18 naked cowboys in the shower, right? <laughs> Just oh. Okay. Wait, what? <laughs> uh, monkeys can climb. Crickets can leap. Horses. Sorry. Horses can race. Owls can seek. Fetus can run. Eagles can fly. People can try. And that's about it. Nice. Oh. Yeah. I feel that. <laughs> Told you you weren't gonna like it. I like it. Huh? It's the, quit lying. <laughs> I am. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so convinced that I wouldn't like it? Well... <laughs> uh... So, just suppose... <laughs> just suppose... Everyone in high school thinks that Ryan has to be all sophisticated and whatnot. So people don't even take my writing seriously. But isn't that the point of poems for people to express themselves? Your writing self wouldn't make your message any less valid. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I like when it's easy to read, but hits you hard. Like this poem. Or like my fist. <laughs> like my Well, fist. damn. <laughs> uh, seeing everyone around you do great things can be really disheartening. So I decide to write about it. 
yeah, I understand. But the other nice thing about simple writing is that it puts more weight on the wordplay. See, see, like, I set up for a rhyme at the end, but I made it all fall flat on purpose. I really can't tell where your accent is supposed to be from. <laughs> Me either. Please, <laughs> God. <laughs> it, helps, it helps bring out the feeling in the last line. <laughs> so you did. I guess more went into it than I realized. That's what it means to be a pro. I'm glad you learned something. Didn't expect that from the youngest one here, did you? Yeah, I guess not. I decided to humor her with the last comment. I don't really care how old everyone is, but Natsuki is feeling proud, then I won't take that away from her. Phew! Oh, damn, my fucking voice cracked. I see the Southerner. I guess that's <laughs> I, I glance around. No! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> yeah, that was a little more stressful than I anticipated. It's as if everyone is judging me for a mediocre writing abilities. Even if they're just being nice, there's no way no my poems can stand up to theirs. Mm. This is a literature club, after all. I sigh. I guess that's what I ended up getting myself into. Across the room, Sayori and Monica are happily chatting. My eyes land on Yuri and Natsuki. They gingerly, gingerly exchange sheet of paper, sharing their respective poems. As they read in tandem, I watch each of their expressions change. Natsuki's eyebrows furrow in frustration. Meanwhile, Yuri smiles sadly. What is with this language? <laughs> uh huh? Um, did I say something? Oh, did you, you say something? Shit. You didn't say nothing that I did, uh, but never mind that. It's nothing. Natsuki <laughs> 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 dismissively returns the poem to the desk with one hand. Yes, you could say it's fancy. Uh, thanks. Yours is cute. You? Did you? Uh, miss the symbolism or something? It's about the feeling of giving up. How, how's that cute? I don't... I know that. I just mean... The language, I guess. I was trying to say something nice. Uh, yeah. You mean you have to try hard with... Try that hard to come up with something nice to say. Or... Thanks, but it really didn't come out as nice at all. Um. Well, I do have a couple of suggestions. All right, let's hear them. <laughs> <laughs> if I was looking for suggestions, <laughs> never mind. I don't want to hear them. I want to have someone who actually <laughs> liked it. <laughs> never mind. I don't want to hear. Them. Which people did, by the way. <laughs> so you already liked it. I didn't. Rigby liked it. So based on that, That's I'll gladly <laughs> give you some suggestions of my own. First of all... Excuse me. I appreciate the offer, but I've spent a long time establishing my writing style. I don't expect it to change anytime soon, unless, of course, I come across something particularly inspiring. Which I haven't yet. What? What is this bullshit? N oh. Don't say it, Don't say it, don't get cancelled. Don't get cancelled! <laughs> 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 oh, I get it. It's just something they're saying to say that. Too, okay. You know. Cool. Alright. So did you receive this? Yep. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I'm still hooked up. Uh, the... He <laughs> anyway. even told me he was impressed by it. So take that, Natsuki. Natsuki suddenly. That's the sound of me. Natsuki suddenly stands up. Oh. 
Is that so? I didn't realize you were so invested in trying to impress our new member, Yuri. That's not what I... Uh, you, you just... Yuri stands up as well. Maybe you're just jealous that Rigby appreciates my advice more than he appreciates yours. And how do you know that he didn't appreciate my advice more? Are you that full of yourself? I... No. If I was full of myself, I would deliberately go out of my way to make everything I do overly cutesy. Oh, you bitch. You... <laughs> um... <laughs> those are Sorry, Is everyone okay? Well, you know what? <laughs> I wasn't the one who... Wait, what the fuck? I wasn't the one whose boobs magically grew a size bigger as soon as Rigby started showing up. <laughs> Natsuki! That was Sayori! <laughs> Ah, yay! <laughs> Natsuki, that's true, but also a little... And this does this not doesn't involve, involve you! Okay, fine. I don't like you yes. fighting, guys. Fight, 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 fight! <laughs> Rigby, fight, 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 fight! fight. <laughs> Suddenly, both the girls turn towards me. As if they just noticed I was standing there. Oh, Rigby. No. She's just trying to make me look bad. That's not true. She started it. <laughs> if she could get over herself and learn how to appreciate that little simple writing is a little more effective, then this wouldn't have happened in the first place. What's the point of making your poems all convoluted for no gosh darn reason? The meaning should jump out at the reader and not force them to have to figure it out. Help me explain this to her, Rigby, come on. <laughs> Wait. There's a reason we have so many deep and expressive words in our language. It's the only way to convey complex feelings and meaning the most effectively. Avoiding them is not only unnecessarily limiting yourself, it's also a waste. You understand that, right, Rigby? Um, well? Well? Fight. Fight. Uh, can you guys continue fighting, please? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't have any more dialogue for this. this in the first place. <laughs> It's not like I know anything about writing, but whoever I agree with, they'll probably think more highly of me. So, of course, that's going to be... Let's pull out the big gun, Sayori! Natsuki. Natsuki glare glares at me, dying, drying up any words I had in my mouth. So instead I turn to Yuri. Yuri. But Yuri's expression is so defenseless that I can't bring myself to say anything to her. Sayori! <laughs> uh? Yeah! <laughs> Everyone's fighting is making Sayori uncomfortable. How can the two of you keep fighting when you know you're making your friend feel like this? Rigby. Well, that's not her problem. This ain't about her. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. It's unfair f for others to interject their own feelings into our conflict. Yeah, unless Sayori wants to tell Yuri about what a stuck-up jerk she's been. She would never! It's your immaturity that made her upset in the first place. Excuse me? <laughs> Are you listening to yourself? <laughs> this is exactly why... Exactly why nobody like... <laughs> Stop! Line. Natsuki, Yuri. You guys are my friends. I just want everyone to get along and be happy. My friends are wonderful people. And I love them because of their differences. Natsuki's poems 
They're amazing because they give you so many feelings with just a few words. And Yuri's poems are amazing because they paint beautiful pictures in your head. Everyone's so talented. So why are we fighting? Because... <laughs> well... Also, Natsuki's cute and there's nothing wrong with that. And Yuri's boobs are as the same as they always were. <laughs> Big and beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh, oh my. Hell yeah, Sayori. Sayori. Sayori stands triumphantly. Oh, oh, Sayori stands triumphantly. Don't you start with that shit. <laughs> Monica stands behind her with a bewildered expression. I'll make some tea. Oh shit, I'm gonna Snapchat. <laughs> Yuri rushes off. Natsuki sits down, a blank expression on her face. Staring at nothing. Damn. <laughs> she ponders about the universe. So, this is why Sayori is vice president. I whisper to Monica. She nods in return. <laughs> well, to be honest, I might come off as a good leader and I can organize things, but I'm not very good with people. Yeah, you suck, Monica. Yeah, they're all little shits. <laughs> I can't even bring myself to interject. It was just too fun. As president, that's kind of embarrassing of me. <laughs> nah. It's not like I can blame you. I wasn't able to say anything earlier. Well, I guess that just means Siri is amazing in her own ways, isn't she? You could say that. She might be an airhead, but sometimes it's weirdly suspicious that she knows exactly what she's doing. Hmm? I see what you're doing at all times as well. <laughs> oh. Take good care of her. I would hate to see her get herself hurt. Mm. <laughs> that makes two of us. You can count on me. <laughs> Uh-oh. Monica smiles sweetly at me, causing my stomach to not. Such a genuine person really does make a good president, regardless of what she says. If only I could get the chance to talk to her a little more. Okay, everyone. It's just about time for us to leave. How did you all feel about sharing your poems? It fucking sucked, Monica. It was a ton of fun! I know. <laughs> Well, I'd say it was worth it. Mm. It was all right, mostly. <laughs> yeah, it's not a lot coming from you. <laughs> Rigby, how about you? Yeah, I'd say the same. It was a neat thing to talk about with everyone. Oh, awesome. In that case, we'll do the same thing tomorrow. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> you wrote yourselves into this corner. <laughs> 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 Maybe you learn something from your friends, too. So your poems will turn out even better. Mm, debatable. <laughs> mm, it won't. I think to myself, I did learn a little more about the kinds of poems everyone likes. With any luck, that means I, uh, I can do at least <laughs> a better job expressing <laughs> those who want to impress who I want to impress. I nod to myself with a newfound determination. Baby! Ready to walk home? Sure. Let's go. <laughs> Sayori beams at me. This one is it truly has been a while since Sayori and I have spent this much time together. Can't really say I'm not enjoying it. Either. Why <laughs> well, do have to put it like that, bitch? <laughs> 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 well, <Sayori>. damn. <laughs> Rigby's the fucking worst. He is. <laughs> <laughs> About what happened earlier. Uh, what do you mean? You know, between Yuri and Natsuki? Does that thing. Does that kind of thing happen often? No, no. That's really the first time I've seen them fight like that. I promise they're both wonderful people. You don't. You don't hate them, do you? No. No, I don't hate Jesus them! Jesus Christ! <laughs> We're in a <laughs> suburb! I just wanted 
your opinion. What is up? Where are your there? voice? I can see why they'd make good friends with you. <laughs> Phew. You know, Rigby, it's nice that I get to spend time with you in the club. But I think seeing you get along with everyone is what makes me the happiest. And I think everyone really likes you, too. That's... <laughs> Every day is gonna be so much fun! Sigh... <laughs> <sighs> it looks like Sayori still hasn't caught on to the kind of situation I'm in. Sure, being friends with everyone is nice, but... Does it really need to stop He doing? wants to fuck. Just, he I wants to talk out late. He wants to take it to the barn if you know what I'm... We'll just have to see what the future holds, Sayori. I've had Sayori on the shoulder. I said that... I said that more to myself than to her, but it's easy to use the area as an internal monologue sometimes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do this. <laughs> What's up? Wait! <laughs> I'm gonna stand over here now. Okay. <laughs> Who's the area? Sing a CR. No, Sorry, yeah? Right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Joe. Yeah. yeah. Nothing too cutesy. Yes, it's something too cutesy. I know the stuff. Nothing too cutesy. And, uh. That's cutesy. Oh, and no. no. That's, uh. Sari's would probably be <laughs> shopping. Uh. Ah, fuck. No, it's me. Oh, wow. <laughs> Sunny. Sunny. Sunny, yeah. Hope. Yeah. There oh. we go. Childhood! Childhood, yeah. yep. Heart. Heart. Hell yeah. Climax? No. Skipping. Skipping. Shit. No, that's me. No, no, too cutesy. Sadness. Holiday. Mm, hopeless would probably be Yuri. Sadness okay. probably. Yeah, that's my again. Oh. Yeah, that's my again. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, clumsy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the Here, wonderful. Oh, no, Mm. Wonderful. Electricity, wonderful. wonderful. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Melody. <laughs> no, no. Unrequited. That's me. No. Shit. Stop. Entropy. Entropy. Don't keep going. Don't keep going. Stop. Entropy. 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 Ent Friends would probably. Friends, friends. Okay. That works too. Uh, uh, sunset. Uh, yep. If anything, if we don't know, just go for a Yuri one because we're not gonna get Yuri. <laughs> um. This one. Uh, just go for a Yuri one. Just go for a Yuri one. That's think he's always. Graveyard. Bro. Oh, well, mother. Oh, shit. <laughs> I swear it's built into his brain. Nibble! Okay, precious. there we go. That was, that was good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> it's built into your brain. It is. It really is, huh? There we go. Alrighty, guys. So, if you didn't know, uh, I'm back. Yeah. Uh, this thing pops up. It's for the, for the console or the new thing. So. I didn't know before pop this this not this screen but the screen with the loading did pop up first so I found that new but it went straight into the Doki Doki uh literature club game menu, main menu first but what I don't what I didn't know what me and my friends found out afterwards is that there is a miniature or virtual desktop in the game so if I click log in it'll root and I already chose the wallpaper and everything Oh my god, look at this. You can choose, if you click this, uh, it takes me straight to the game. Here, there are side stories. The side stories are stories of friendship that are unrelated to the events of the main game. To get all six stories, try writing poems for different characters and viewing their special scenes in DDLC. Okay, so... 
You know what that means. Uh, I will be playing the main game, but main... As you can see, I was playing the main game, but... Next time, we'll be doing uh, the side stories. And I will have to go back and rewrite one of the poems I did before saving. Uh, I do want to try to get uh, a different uh, side story by unlocking more poems for different characters. So, there's this trust, part one. Understanding, part one. And this is for each of the, the Doki Doki, the, the waifus. So there's files, there's characters, click on that, shows all the files. This is, I won't spoil anything for people who haven't played the game already. If you're wondering, yeah, I have played the game already uh, back in 2017. Uh, yeah, so people who are playing on console can come here just like as we would in the previous uh, iteration, the original. And it's just, everything's in here. It's so cool. So we can delete and we can open. But here we, we can't open because uh, it's not actually using, I, I want to say real computer files as the original DDL, DDLC. Here we have mail. Not sure what that's about. We have pictures, which shows all of this. Hold up. We have also music. shows all of this. These are the new soundtracks. All this is the original uh, soundtrack from the original game. The new sound, new music is so nice. Settings. You can see data collected 17%. Nice, nice. Pictures, we have this. I can turn it as a wallpaper for this uh, virtual PC or makeshift PC on the thing on the game, the DDLC, main cover art, Sayori, Natsuki, Yuri, Monica, the chibi versions, and I do have a chibi Natsuki plushie right here, so, yeah, <laughs> exactly like, so if I keep scrolling, we have all this, Write your poem for Sayori in both first and second poem games. Oh, so we have to go back. Oh, I wonder if we... Mm, okay. Try not to spoil the game for people who haven't played it already. If you haven't played the game already and you are able to uh, purchase this game, I highly recommend it. This game is amazing. And if you want, you can play the original game first. And then you can go ahead and do the side stories. What I'm probably going to do is do the side stories in between the actual game. So I'm going to do the first few Sayori side stories before uh, the first act finishes. And I have reasons for that. Some people might know. But yeah, the, we have the concept art, promo, sketches, backgrounds, secrets. CGs. I haven't unlocked any secrets, but I'll we'll try to see. But anyways, that's all I wanted to show you. I already, I already uh, said bye to you guys, but why not say bye once again? Hope you enjoyed. Have a fantastic day. Bye bye.